Hey, what's up? It's time for more Crash Landing on You. This is episode 13. We are coming very close to the end of this show. There's only 16 episodes in this show. Um, so yeah, we're very close. I know that the final episode is like super long, I'm pretty sure. Um, but, uh, but yeah, that we're still very close. So, uh, I'm looking forward to this. Last episode was, I think, from memory, wasn't it my favorite episode so far? I think it was. It was either... I, it was either our last episode or the episode before that, but I think it was last episode. Um, and it was a, it was just a, a great episode. It had everything that I liked, and it had, like, humor, emotion. It progressed the story nicely, I feel like. Um, didn't seem to waste too much, if any, time, um, other than the, you know, occasional flashback and stuff. But, um, but it was still good. It was very good. So I was, I'm looking forward to this next episode, episode 13. And uh, we're going to jump right into it. Make sure to support the video and the channel if you can. Leave your comments down below and go to my Patreon account if you want the full-length reactions. You can watch the entire episode with me. you just got to sync it up with your own footage. And, uh, and then you're ready to go. So let's jump into this episode 13 of Crash Landing on You. <laughs> Sometimes I plan to cry, but... I can't always live up to my plans. <laughs> Bambi syndrome. Uh -huh. Okay, well, you're not dear. <laughs> I understand the metaphor. I mean, that's a that's a actual real worry. <laughs> but I don't want you to. <laughs> I want you to stay with her. Screw everyone back in your home city. He got caught up. <laughs> I'm starting to like him more and more every episode. Now that he's like buying into it more. Yeah. Oh my god, get this guy out of here. Yeah, arrest him. Wouldn't it be great if he was like unceremoniously arrested right there? What? Why were the, the lights on the police car going if he just drove away? Weren't they there for him? <laughs> He's so proud. Those are... Terrible candles. <laughs> that look he gave her. He likes her in the hat. This is a fun song. Make your wish. Well, yeah, but you're the one blowing out the candles, Sari. Everyone's doing it together? Cute. Is that a Korean tradition or is that something that she did? Just because, like, everyone blowing out the candles at the same time. What have you got? <laughs> I mean, she's a rich girl. Something big isn't what she cares about. Scented candle. 
그래서 so I what? I drew you a picture. 식품은 당신이 좋아하는 전당포에 갖다 맡겨도. Oh my god, give her the fucking thing. 아 줘봐요. 여자한테 선물 처음 줘봐. 뭘 이렇게 떨어. Oh, it's a ring. <laughs> a thumb ring. Oh, that one's mine. They have matching rings. <laughs> oh my god. They're moving so fast. <laughs> I guess they don't have time to move slow anymore. Mm, yeah, she's happy with it. <laughs> That's a big compliment from a rich girl. Is this building up to a kiss? Are you two gonna kiss? You're just gonna look at each other. They're just gonna look at each other. Oh. Here comes the bribery. <laughs> I mean, in a way, no, but she might soon. <laughs> Is he going to be able to charm his way out of this? Oh my god. She's charms. <laughs> I like that she's like cuddling up with the bottle. 아직 저녁 전이시죠? 나오셔서 식사하세요. <웃음> Dan looks so hungover. 하나같이 그 어떤 식탁이라도 이게 빠질 순 없죠. 오? 기름. 그럼 우리 단이랑은 그 어떤 릴레이션십 Wife to be. 그냥 제가 혼자 사단 씨한테 와우 반한 상태입니다. 그분이랑. <laughs> so surprisingly honest. Or bold, I guess. <laughs> oh my god. I think we're watching Dan sober up in real time. She started so like slunched, slunched, slouched, hunched. <laughs> I mean, he may literally never come back. For multiple reasons. He might die, or he might just stay there. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're pissing off the wrong people. Man. <laughs> Insane. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Careful! Oh my god. <laughs> This is so exciting for them, though. <laughs> I wish someone incredibly rich would give me a credit card and say, buy whatever you want. I, I think the most exciting thing is them going to eat at places. They can go eat at super expensive places. Like, items would be hard to take back, but at least you can have the experience of eating. <laughs> Damn. It is stylish. 
<laughs> Buy it in every color. <laughs> Why? Well, to be fair, Sari did say buy whatever you want. <laughs> yeah, why would we? She cleans her own house. Isn't that irresponsible? My God. <gasps> oh. Okay. Mm. Okay, that's good. Okay, good. <laughs> of course he is. He's very often jealous. <laughs> this is very nice, except for the fact they're leaving each other soon. And they're like acknowledging that they're the one for each other. Aww. Yeah. It's a clicking. It's setting in. Swiss. He's laying it on thick. Aww. That's a lot to process for a person. Like, we've met before. That's very nice and ominous. <laughs> Hope she doesn't die by the end of the series. I'm so happy for them. Eating chi chicken together on someone else's dime. <laughs> now they're into it. <laughs> they're on a sports high. Ah, uh, the <laughs> even Sari's into it. And Ree's just happy to be there. <laughs> hey! <laughs> she... <laughs> She's paying for so much lately. What? Ah, oh, they're doing that game again, right? <laughs> That's great. That's a great little song as well. I'm liking these Korean songs. Here we generally go, we like to drink with Gent, cause Gent is our mate. And when we drink with Gent, he gets it out in eight, seven. Shit, man. Oh. Wow. This poor guy, man. He's been through enough. Oh my god. I god, man. He's got people on him. Oh my god. Snap his neck right now.
you wouldn't be strong enough to do that. <laughs> He's so giddy. They're about to find out about each other's character in game yet. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting Oh my god. Fight now. Oh, is he grabbing the pillow? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't jump on the bed while someone's sleeping on it. <laughs> if you're hungry. If you're hungry, stop crying. Man, it's okay. We all get hungry sometimes. Oh god, this poor man. I thought he could finally like be moving past all that trauma. And he gets dragged back into it. Oh, future daughter-in-law's mother. This is nephew. Got it. Understood. <laughs> Took me a little to follow that connection, but I got it. <laughs> They're so loud. <laughs> She's frozen. She did not know how to handle that situation. Dan's actor is so good. <laughs> she had to move away quickly. Whoa. Look at that scenery. Yes, but... Yeah. And then theoretically he's coming back. She's going to push you off this bridge. Oh my god! Oh, I, we have never seen this side of her. ボイスプレイさ着いたこっちだれ。南朝鮮에서 <laughs> 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 Damn. He looks completely different. Oh my god, the scarf. Oh my god. <laughs> Not really subtle, you two are the only ones in here. Aww. <laughs> Oh my god. He can't hold it together. <laughs> Aww. I'm happy for him. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> it's a dream come true. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna hold it sacred for the rest of his life. Oh, he got a picture out of it. That's so cute. I hope that doesn't end up being like evidence used against him or something. Okay, well, don't say that though. Because <laughs> we don't want you to die today. Oh, he gets head fats. Good. Fragrant scalp. <laughs> yeah. You guys have to say so many goodbyes. This show is full of goodbyes. Yeah, every episode. That's true. It's better to say too many goodbyes than too few. 
<웃음> 내가 떠날 준비들은 모두 마쳤나? Oh my gosh. 예. 오가장이라는 사람이 연락을 주고랬고. Shit man. 이 정역과 윤세리의 동선을 내게 알려달라. Oh, oh, I was waiting for this scene. Okay. 깨지는 것 같은데요? 누나 유산을 이렇게 파괴해 버릴 이유가 뭐야? 너 그때 말했어야 됐어. 내가 너한테 기회 한번 줬을 때. Oh my god. 네가 제일 모자라니까 그런 거야. he picked you as because you were a disappointment and you disappointed him. <laughs> That's how much of a disappointment you are. She's coming in with divorce papers. Mm. <laughs> hmm. Oh my god, it's crazy she's still got plays left in her. No, you gotta shut up. <laughs> You're gonna ruin everything. Oh my god. You're not a good actor, my man. I mean, the actor's a good actor, but the character's not a good actor. <laughs> Oh my god, this is not Sari's fault. <laughs> None of this is her fault. Oh god, of course. Oh my god. This guy is such a sc I mean, both these guys are such scumbags. No. Oh. He still got the same job as he had back then. No, oh, this is a disaster. This is so bad. Oh my gosh. Actually, she's not screaming right now. I would be screaming. Oh my god. Oh, they're cutting away. Oh my god. What's he gonna do? What's he going to do? Kill everyone here? Give himself up? My woman. <laughs> no way! No way! You can take out this whole crowd! Oh my god! Damn, this is crazy. I thought, oh, I was about to say, I thought he could take like three, four guys at once, maybe. Not like 20, but now he's starting to lose. Oh, oh, <laughs> they look kind of awesome. Oh, he did end up telling him? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Cross her fingers so they're allowed to lie. That was well set up. Okay, this was all part of the plan. That's why she wasn't screaming in the car. Oh! <laughs> oh, yeah! My boys! And they're all good fighters. This is great. <laughs> oh! Wow, he's got a hard head. 
Yeah, he's kind of awesome. This is the coolest he's been in the show. <laughs> nice. Good fighting style. That'd be how I'd fight. <laughs> it's the boys. Oh my god. I love the suits. They're so cool. <laughs> Ri could take most of you on by himself. Now he's got backup. Oh my god. Get him now. Attack him now. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. Did he get hit? Oh, cool. Pyochi Su's so cool in these scenes. Oh no. No, this guy is so annoying. Oh my god, don't let him get away. No. Oh, come on, Sari. Can you do something, please? Oh. Oh, shit. You have to do something, Sari. Please. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. What can you do? What can you do? Oh. My. God. Did she get hit? No way. Shoot. Okay, good shot. You gotta shoot again. Yep. Oh no, oh no. Oh yes. Oh. Do it. Do it. Do it! Oh! Where was she shot? Or did she just fall asleep because she had a big day? I can't see where the bullet hole is. Oh my god. No. Okay, yeah, you can show me all the sweet flashbacks, but... There's no way she said. There's no way. We have three episodes left. There's no way. <laughs> what could they possibly do for three episodes? She just has to go into a coma or something. I don't know. Oh, okay. Okay, there's the bullet hole. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh, this does feel like a death scene, though. Could it be one? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Man, he's great this episode. <laughs> well, you guys didn't do a great job with that. Unless they do something now. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> well, um. Oh my god. I. I don't know, man. <laughs> is, is she actually dead? It. They. They played that like a full death scene. Like. They're. In another type of show, I I would have just said, yeah, that that's the character's death. I don't know. Would you do that? Like one in this show, two with three episodes left of this show. I felt like this show is like a has very dark themes, at, but is always leading towards something incredibly uplifting toward the end. So I feel like maybe they do this so that this is the darkest it can possibly get. 
but it like they find a way to make it uplifting at the end i i feel like in my mind what's gonna happen i think if there was one episode left i would i would feel some like a lot more confident that she is dead but three episodes like these are long episodes this show is long this show, each episode is like, like a mini movie or a movie. So, like, there, are, there's a lot of content left. And if the content was, was based around just um, Re and his squad and Dan and Goo back home, like, it is there enough there to carry three episodes, you know? So... So I feel like she's not dead. I feel like she is like on the precipice of dying and she like maybe will go in a coma. Like I wouldn't be surprised if she wasn't in the next two episodes or something because she was just recovering. And then the final episode she comes out of a coma or something. I don't know, but I don't know. Damn. Um. Well... I had other stuff to talk about that seems a lot less um, fun to talk about now <laughs> after that episode. I will say this was Pio's best episode. Like as a character that like, you know, started off as like a very obnoxious character um, and he was kind of the buzzkill of the group. Like it, they, they've done a great job at like developing him throughout the series to the point where like in this episode he did so much right he like he did still make tiny little um mocking jabs but they felt you know now they feel like friendly fun mocking jabs rather than like being mean to someone um and then uh he looked really cool in the action scenes he um he i mean he was dressed well in in some of the scenes he cried over seri at the end there like he was he he said to re in the after credit scene how um like their commander was more important than their country like he did some great things this episode huge props to him he was he was great um all the, all the fighting stuff was cool like just it was pretty hype moment to get like um to have like re face off against that many guys and hold them off until his squad got there and i liked the whole like making us feel the despair of seeing uh seri get, get like captured and stuff but then revealing that it was all part of their plan like i like stuff like that so that was nice um i uh i, I think the rings uh gift that uh re gave series very sweet he gave gave them well gave her a ring to match his ring that he bought as well which is very sweet um and i mean it is basically a marriage proposal like he he knows they can't get married but it's like a it's like a, we might as well be married you know like if i was staying here this would be a marriage proposal um but i mean this also feels like the sort of show that if Sari is alive, it feels like the last episode would be a, a wedding of some sort. Like, they would fully just go go through with a, a full wedding. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so that was very nice. Um, I liked seeing the, uh, <laughs> the happy birthday song for North Korea. I think that, that was, that was kind of cool. I, I find happy birthday songs pretty interesting, you know, because I think the, the, you know, regular happy birthday song is actually kind of boring. So, um, so like if there was something like that, like I really liked that those, those songs, like it was the happy birthday song and the drinking song both had like a one more time type part of it, <laughs> which is really cool. Like it, it, you, you did one verse of it and then you speed up for the second verse of it. And that's, that's fun. You know, that's, that's a lot more fun for groups of people to sing because it has like a super high energy when the happy birthday, the generic happy birthday song is pretty slow. Surprisingly happy birthday to you. Like that's the more I think about it, that's not really a party type song, but if you're doing a song where you're clapping along and you're going faster and faster, like that's, 
That's a celebration song. I love it. Um, uh, I, man, something that was crazy was in this episode seeing Dan crying, like when she heard everything that was going on, and we actually straight up saw her cry. Haven't seen that before, I don't think, and that was that was crazy, um, and that hurt to see, because I care about that character a lot. I do. I think you should think she's a great character, and I do want her to be happy, even though. You know, she's m made a lot of mistakes and she, uh, I think, at, at some point should be an understanding of the fact that, you know, she can't have own, she shouldn't have the ownership of, of Ri when he's clearly not interested, you know, like there should be a point where she's able to like take a step back and go, okay, this um, he's not into this, <laughs> he doesn't love me back, and I can't make him love me. Um, but, uh, but I do want her to be happy, but I, like, luckily enough, I do still think they're setting up her and Goo, and that by the end of the series, I think she will probably be happy. Um, and finally, I liked the, uh, the credit card thing in this episode of, of, um... Sari just giving them a credit card and going like go nuts with this and you know what I like I like that they actually They didn't really go nuts with it. They were actually Surprisingly respectful of her money <laughs> even though she said like y use all of my fortune if you need to um, Obviously probably knowing that they they wouldn't they they wouldn't do that like the stuff that they want is like they want to eat fried chicken and get some cool hats like they they're, they're not gonna go out and get like private jets and stuff but um but it like it was very nice that she gave them that and then afterwards she was like i told you guys to like splurge on yourselves and you really didn't get yourselves much at all so i got you gifts instead like it was i just think that's really sweet she's so sweet with them it's adorable anyway um well, maybe I should say she was so sweet with them because she might be dead now. So I guess we'll find out next episode. This is episode 13. Wow, 13 as well. Unlucky number. Um, thank you so much for joining me. Make sure to support the video and the channel if you can. Like, comment, and subscribe. Especially commenting down below helps me out a lot. And go to my Patreon account, which is in the description below for the full-length reactions as well as early access and exclusive videos for certain shows. Excuse me. Um, and, uh, and go, if you like stuff like One Piece, go check out my Gent Watches One Piece channel for extra content as well. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time, goodbye.